Hey folks, Randy with Pete's RV TV here today with you. Today we're going to be looking at the 312BH Outback, probably one of Outback's the most popular floor plans that they've ever produced. Um, this uh, is a great outside kitchen bunkhouse unit that just really kind of changed the industry a couple years ago, and just a great floor plan. This guy's going to be tough to beat. So you can see we've got the front cap on the Outback, which really helps with those leaks. Uh, um, as the unit starts to get some age on it, that's all fiberglass, the brown's all dyed right in, really aerodynamic, great way to do it, love to see it on the Outback. Um, two 30 pound LP tanks, place for a couple batteries down there. This guy's also going to come equipped with a battery disconnect, so real nice when we're putting our camper away for the end of the weekend. Uh Go ahead and shut that battery off. We can see our front storage compartment here. Just a huge storage area, all aluminum construction. That just shows you the, the quality of the build on the Outback. The Outback is not missing anything at all. Um, and the, most of the great features on the Outback, the usability of this camper, comes from a group of people called the Outbackers Club, which I've talked about in some other videos. And these guys are avid campers that love the Outback product and just make a lot of recommendations that the manufacturer listens to to make this a great usable camper for anybody that's been camping for a while. A lot of things make sense on the Outback. That's why it's one of my favorite products. One of the things uh, in regards to that is uh, this below the floor storage. Put our blocking, our hoses, anything that's going to be wet and dirty that we don't want to put up in that storage there with our clean stuff. Store it down there. Our jacks are turned at an angle. We've got a wider door. We've got three steps going into the unit. We've actually got a light below that uh, washes the those stair treads as we're getting uh, into our camper uh, after dark. Uh, make it nice and easy to see those stairs. We can see the large grab handle, gas and electric, uh, hot water heater, outside speakers. And we've got the campsite theater from out back. We can take the TV and put it right out here. Um, scare light outside, electric awning. Aluminum wheels, suspension dampening system we can kind of see between the wheels in there. Um, that's just going to keep everything where you left it when you're going down the road with this guy inside the camper. Um, sewer flush comes standard on the, the Outback uh, line. Love to see it. Keep that monitor panel reading clean. See, we've even got a second big grab handle on the rear door. You do not see that. We've also got the three steps on the rear door as well. Here's a great outside kitchen. Another place to hook up a TV. You can have more TVs than a TV store hooked up in this guy. Um, we've got the two burner stove. Um, you know, if you're a, a wonderful cook like me that creates a lot of smoke and sometimes fire, great way to camp, uh, do some cooking outside. We don't want that inside the unit. We see we got the bigger refrigerator there. Tons of storage. This does come equipped with a grill on the back. There's the bracket for it. The grill will be inside the coach for storage. Spare tire. Uh, satellite and cable TV hookup. You can't go camping without cable TV. Um, just some great features here on the Outback. Um, Outback is probably one of my favorite product lines just because of the usability that I talked about a little earlier in the video. And they do a great job constructing it as well. Outback is probably one of the best built travel trailers that I carry here at Pete's RV and one of the best built ones in the industry. Um, linoleum through the high traffic patterns. We can see the big couch there which is going to give us some extra sleeping as well. The great horseshoe dinette with a movable table. We can take that table and put it in front of the couch and watch TV while we're eating dinner. Bring it outside if need be. A lot of great large windows in the sky. That TV there as we walk into the coach as well as our uh, Bluetooth stereo DVD player. Um, that TV will turn around into the bedroom area here into the master bedroom. You see we've got the longer bed. We've got uh, pockets next to the bed on either side. Outlets next to the bed. Um, it's a great place to charge our cell phone, CPAP machine, whatever we need. His and her uh, wardrobe, storage above the bed. Great place to see the radius ceiling in here as well. Four and a half more inches of headroom all the way through the outback. Uh, just makes it nicer for those taller people out there. Unlike uh, unlike me, and it's about five foot two uh, with my boots on. <laughs> anyway, great uh, use of space here in the kitchen area. Love to see it in a bunkhouse unit. Tons of counter space. Three burner stove with the oven. Again, more storage. Just plenty of places to put anything that you may need to bring with you. You can see the two tone cabinetry a little bit there in the video as well. That's an outback trait. Storage above the fridge. We've got that big uh, gas and electric refrigerator here. Outback has storage underneath uh, both dinettes as well with big drawers that pull out there. Outback is the only one uh, in the industry right now doing that. Uh, so a great place to bring a lot of the heavier cookware and store it there. We've even got cup holders. If you want to stick a libation in there so you don't lose it, <laughs> we've even got it on the Outback. Over into our bunk area. You can see it's all carpeted, so if you're a tenderfoot like me, uh, you can walk around with your socks on and no problems there. This particular one has the couch option in it, so that will open up and make into a bed or a great place for the kids to hang out on those poor weather days. We've got a bunk above that. This bunk does fold up, so when you are sitting on the couch, so you don't have uh, that bunk in your way. It is held up with struts, so a real nice way to do it. 
big window in the back of the outback there. You can see uh, the back lawn here at Pete's RV in Burlington, Vermont location. Another thing I talk about, the Burlington, Vermont location, the beautiful Burlington, Vermont location. We ship anywhere in uh, North America, so don't let uh, me being in Burlington, Vermont hold you back from giving us a call. I also have a uh, location in Indiana we can ship out of as well if you're uh, part of the West Coast market. So we can take care of you anywhere, and we run some great shipping rates and have specials on them at all the times. See, we've got a place to put the TV in the outback. Another great bunk area up there. Some more storage uh, opposite of the bathroom, so some fallout uh, storage from the bunk room, or uh, if we need a place to put some more uh, um, amenities for the bathroom, we got a great place to put them there. We can see the depth of our slide here as well, with windows all the way around that slide, so we just feel like we're sitting in part of the camper, not a, a box that's uh, outside the camper. Love to see it. We can see our entertainment center. This is a great view of the camper. Quick view to our bathroom here. We've got the, the high uh, porcelain toilet, nice and easy to get off, on and off of if you're an old guy like me. Places to hang your towels, just something as simple as that. Uh, a lot of guys don't do that, but that you know that, that's a nice way to do it. You don't have to do it after the sale. It's already done for you, and that's something that the Outback really um, thinks about. Even in here, you got a laundry hamper. Get those dirty clothes off the floor. Keep them underneath the sink. Great place to store them uh, until we get a chance to do the laundry. Um, and there's Randy in the mirror in the vanity. Again, we've got uh, the shower dome and the surround in our shower. Nice garden tub here. Um, anyway, there's the Outback 312. One of the most popular selling floor plans uh, from Keystone and from Pete's RV. Great unit. It's going to be hard to, to one-up this guy. So if you're thinking uh, bunkhouse floor plan with the outside kitchen, give Randy a call at Pete's RV. Um, I can also be reached by email. It's Randall at Pete's RV is my email address. And I'd love to talk to you and I'd love to show you some more of the great features on the Outback. So um, if you're thinking about a family uh, camper with the outside kitchen, the Outback's a great candidate for you. Call me and I'll tell you why. Thanks again for watching Randy here today and uh, thanks for thinking Pete's RV.